during that period, we can actually move people faster because without checking. So this is actually the new Fair Family that we have introduced on the 8th of April. It's light. So you still have your cabin baggage, basically your hand carry. Okay. When we did this, we made it very, very clear that no sign of It's always been there. For the longest years, for any other airlines, to say 7 kilogram hand carry baggage. Stacks and barrage, we still continue to have. So the kacang is still there. <laughs> okay, if you're going to continue to you still get your last lemma. It's still there. Even for light, not the other airlines. <laughs> no check baggage, that's the only thing that we have pulled out. Because from our analysis and we've sat down with so this is actually market feedback. So we actually conducted a couple of forums with our corporate clients, with people who fly with us, and say, look, I don't really need the check-in baggage. So we removed the check-in baggage. When we remove that, we have actually reduced our fares from basic. So if so you notice the WhatsApp message that was going around that made it sound like, hey, you know, MH has removed everything. No, that option is always here. And the price is the same as what it was before 8th of April, even now. There was also in the WhatsApp group saying that our baggage price is high or very high or whatnot. We are pricing ourselves competitively in the market. So which means if I sell, I can't recall, is it 80 ringgit for 5 kilogram? If you go to another airline, it's that kind of price. So whatever you're seeing there is also wrong. But it's not a fixed price. We, we look at the market. If tomorrow the market says for another 5 kilogram it's 120 ringgit, we follow the 120 ringgit. So we are pricing ourselves competitively in the market. This horizontal fair family has been introduced at a lot of premium carriers as well, full service carriers like Lufthansa. If you don't believe really, you go to Lufthansa and check it, right? Why, to answer your question, why is it um, domestic? It's because one of the few things, the differential, the difference in terms of the attributes is the check in baggage. And we realized, that's why I said just now, we did a, our own analysis on our own data. 75% to 80% of the people who travel domestically, especially within Peninsula, does not have check-in baggage. So it makes sense for us to put this horizontal fair family for domestic. We, we are running this, and if it makes sense, we may extend it to ASEAN countries. We may.